Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys and today guys I'm going to go ahead and be showing you how to add echo to your tracks in BandLab. This is a very simple thing to do guys so make sure to watch this quick in this video till the very end to follow my steps correctly so you can make sure this works the same for you and you can do this yourself. But yeah guys let's get straight into it. So guys the first thing you want to do is go ahead and open up the official BandLab application if you haven't already and after opening it up you want to go ahead and log in to your account if you do not already have an account you can go ahead and create a new one and after logging in you'll be greeted by this main page right here which is the home page of bandlab where you can see all the trending videos you can see all the posts by other users and so on so guys the first thing we want to do is go ahead and open up this plus button right here at the bottom part of the screen in the middle click on plus and it's going to open up this new page where we can get started with either importing a new file or starting to record our new file and so on so go ahead and open up your project i'm going to open up this project right here that i have in the studio and after opening it up this is how it's going to look like we'll be able to see our project we can add other tracks to it we can go ahead and manage with it and so on so basically guys here is what we want to do to be able to use echo we want to go ahead and open up the fx right here so as you can see next to the name of the track is the fx option click on fx and this is going to open up this new menu of all the fx options you can add so as you can see you can see the trending ones the recommended ones and so on and if you scroll down guys you can see here we have the vocals option so we have either to select a 70s ballad 808 and so on you can can find whatever works best for you you can even go ahead and enhance your boost if you want and so on so these are all the fx options that you're going to go ahead and be able to have and as you can see if you search in the upper right corner click the search button and search for echo you can see a lot of options such as echo doubler ambient rocker club echo and so on that you can use for your vocals but yeah guys basically that is it how to do it so i hope this video was helpful if it was make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel so you guys thanks for watching take care and bye